Inside the rubble is 45-year-old garment worker Mijanur Rahman, searching for survivors. He's been working day and night, leading a small team of volunteers. I'm physically tired, but I'm mentally strong. I'm doing this for humanity. Officials say at least 3,500 garment workers were in the building when it collapsed on Wednesday. Witnesses say cracks appeared on the walls before the structure crumbled. The fall of the building or the collapse of the building was due to obvious defects in the building construction. Built in 2007, the eight-story building had five garment factories. 30-year-old Sohel Rana is the owner, and authorities say the complex was built illegally. Garment workers are calling for the death sentence. Tens of thousands of them have been protesting, bringing Dhaka's industrial zone to a standstill. Police fire rubber-coated steel bullets to disperse the crowds. We want justice. We are trying to protest peacefully, but the police are shooting us. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina called for the immediate arrest of all involved in the collapse. Several people were detained, including local government engineers. The garment industry is an important economic sector. Last year, it brought more than $19 billion in revenues. And it employs more than 2 million people who work day and night to make cheap clothes for the world's leading brands. Al Jazeera, Saver, Bangladesh.